Hey guys, Wayne here from HT Tech Videos. Today I'm going to be doing a spec comparison between the ZTE Blade Z Max and the new LG Stylo 4. We're going to put them side by side and see which one has the better specs. So, starting with software, Stylo 4 uh, does jump right out the gate and take it. It does have 8.1 Oreo, which is uh, a much newer version of Android than the Blade Z Max 7.1 Nougat. Screen size, the Stylo 4 just barely beats out the Blade Z Max with a 6.2 inch FHD plus display. Uh, does have 18 by 9 inch ratio, so the screen is um, longer going straight up, whereas the Blade screen is a bit wider, but ultimately it does have a bigger screen size, so it does take it there. When it comes to camera, the Blade Z Max still does take it. Uh, with an 8 megapixel front camera, 16 megapixel rear, with also a dual rear camera as well. So, um, Stylo 4, although it has 5 megapixel front, 13 rear, with the uh, AI built in with the Q lens, ultimately you're going to get a better camera with the Blaze Z Max. Internal memory is going to be about the same. Uh, 32 gigs is going to be on both. Uh, when you strip that down to actually how much you get to use, you do get about, or it's really pretty much about 21 gigs for each phone. The only difference is the expandability with the storage. You can put up to 128 gig micro SD card on the Blaze Z Max. Stylo 4, you can go up to a two terabyte. So that's the only thing that really separates it, but in terms of what you get out of the box, they're both gonna be 32 gigs total with 21 gigs of user storage um, after you minus the uh, built-in software. In terms of battery, Blade Z Max still takes it. 4,000 milliamp battery, where Stylo 4 is only about 3,300. Keep in mind, this is not bad because this is the same size battery that the Note 8 has. So you're still getting a really big battery with the Stylo 4, but obviously you're getting an even bigger one with the Blade. So important thing to note and both models uh, you cannot remove the battery uh, they are sealed unibody phones so you know can't swap it out so obviously if you can get a bigger battery why not processor wise you're going to get a faster processor on Stellar 4 they're both octa-core processors but you will get 1.8 gigahertz with Stylo 4 only 1.4 with the Blade Z Max in terms of the weight Stylo 4 is just a hair lighter very minimal which are about 0.17 versus 0.07 ounces so not crazy crazy of a difference but we did want to point it out finally we go into the special or the extra features while blaze z max does have the fingerprint scanner and the dual camera stylo 4 does jump ahead of it in this category because while it does have fingerprint scanner it also has facial recognition and it has the stylus pen as well so the built-in stylus pen you can use to write and control the phone so we did give uh, extra features to the stylo 4. so these this has been the spec comparison um it's tough these are two really great phones the blade c max came out last year and it's still um pretty awesome i mean if you subtract the software the screen is just about the same as Stylo 4. You are getting a better camera. Storage will be the same. You are getting a bigger battery. Um, the, the one thing that really separates these two phones when you just sort of strip everything down is gonna be the stylus pen. Stylo 4 does come with that nice onboard stylus, um, which can be very useful. And I think that's the one thing that really separates these two phones. Aside from that, um they're they're really similar um so you have to ask yourself um does it make more sense for you to have the onboard stylus and the slightly bigger screen or is the camera more important to you with that 16 megapixel rear dual camera and more battery life that's the decision you have to make do me a favor in the comment section down below let me know between these two phones, which one would you pick based on the specs? Can't wait to hear your feedback, guys. Thanks again for watching. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and make sure you also follow us on Instagram at HG Tech Videos for monthly giveaways and a bunch of other cool stuff. Thanks again for watching, guys. Take care and have a good one.